Hey, good afternoon, guys. Patrick Johnston, uh, managing broker, co-owner of Go Dominican Life, uh, a real estate company here throughout the Dominican Republic. Uh, today, we are with Alex and Mike. We're talking about property management and short-term rentals, talking about the process, uh, the, what we call the onboarding of new clients, and how we handle systems internally to make sure that we can deliver uh, the greatest amount of revenue to, uh, to our clients, but also have the smoothest customer service. Because in the end, uh, that's what it's all about. We want to have good reviews, thumbs up, yep. great compliments or comments along the way so that we can face the world with a positive aspect. So we had a conference call today with uh, Peter Knoll. Uh, Peter is uh, part of our team as well. Peter uh, runs all of the uh, booking systems for all of our short-term rentals. Um, and generates what we call the online lead sourcing to drive the revenue for our customers. While these guys on the ground uh, will be uh, doing everything that's required from the time the person gets off the, at the airport uh, and arrives here in uh, whichever town they're renting. Uh, uh, Sisua, Porto Plata, Cabarete, or Las Terrenas, as example. So we talked about the importance of this, several things, so why don't we just talk in general? Well, um, first thing, uh we spoke about the efficiency, smooth. We want when the client comes, it's like one, two, three, no hassle. So we have the questionnaire. We let them know about our bylaws here, the extra costs like electricity, stuff like that. So nothing's a surprise. So we take it from there, one, two, three. You check in, 24 hours, we're on call if there's a problem. And if there's a language barrier, Alex can help me out with that. Yeah. The Spanish. The Spanish is not that great, but... Uh, not that great. It's Spanish much better than mine. <laughs> a lot better than mine. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So, the process generally is this. Uh, when you buy a piece of property with us, condo or villa, uh, we will offer our management short-term rental service to you as a customer. So, we will send you, uh, for example, uh, an owner's package, an owner's proposal, which will give you all of our recommendations and items that we want you to include so that we can deliver a great product to the customer. We will also do, uh, Peter on the team will do a rental market analysis and look at all the com competition for your t uh, piece of property. So if it's a condo or a villa, or how many bedrooms and how many baths, pool or without pool, location, proximity to the beach, all the variables that we need to make sure that we price it correctly. Then you'll agree or disagree, or most likely you'll agree. And then we proceed to have what we uh, sign a management contract, which is a management contract is as good as the people that sign and deliver on it, both us as a company and, and you, you as, as the company. owner. Uh, so we're, we don't lock anyone in for massive long terms. If we aren't in an incongruent uh, fashion together, we will simply, uh, in a nice way, part ways, and we'll continue on, and you will continue on as well. That's our guarantee to you. But once we go through that onboarding uh, document, and uh, you agree that uh, you're going to proceed in the direction with us, we then take the information and load it into our internal systems. Part of our internal systems are being prepared in advance of the, t the uh, tenant arrival, the renter arrival, and that will allow us to be ready for them with uh, the time of arrival, what air flight plane or flight they're on, what airport they're coming through. We'll have any kind of drink requests or any yeah. special requests uh, confirmed and ready for them. Clear directions. Clear directions, exactly. Right down to a Google uh, link uh, for where the property is located. Yeah. And then, of course, access uh, for 24-hour access uh, and we, so we know what time they're arriving. Yeah. That's very important. And uh, like Patrick says... And even if you don't have a ride from the airport, that could be arranged too. And once you're here, uh, the guests are here, if they need to be locally moved around, we can arrange that as well. Yeah. So it's the full thing. I mean, I mean, if you have to have, if you are the owner, we would see that maintenance of manicuring the yard, the pool, whatever. Yeah. So. At all property management contracts are personalized by each uh, specific owner. Because there's obviously uh, less uh, management issues to deal with in a condominium because generally the condo association looks after the groundskeeping, the pool maintenance, etc. You are literally responsible for behind your front door, but everything else is up to the condo management. Yeah. But with villas, 
we have to uh, take into consideration things such as security, pool, pool maintenance, landscaping, cleaning or deep cleaning, yeah. uh, checklists for all the personal items that are what I call you know, the owner uh, assets and everything from appliances to bedding and pillows to right down to how many forks and knives. Yep. This is a checklist we use in and out on every transaction so that we can be sure that we are collecting the right amount, right amount of money and deducting for uh, neglect or uh, for items that need repair. Yeah, yeah. damage or whatever. Yeah. So, so that, those are the two things. Uh, sorry, that's the first thing. Getting the owner set up, uh, getting your uh, contract set up. Second step is to uh, perfect the uh, tenant communication. That is also specific to each condo or villa or location because it'll have time sensitive items, it'll have specific directions, it'll talk about where the keys are located. Um, everything we do is like a touchless entry, so uh, it's either with Wi Fi or directly on the lock that the client will be issued a code valid at a certain time to open and lock the door. All of our codes are changed after every tenant leaves, so it provides security for those that are. Uh, sitting yeah. in, the, in the accommodation, they know no one else has access to that. Uh, and then we do, uh, we monitor electricity. Uh, here in the Dominican Republic, you can imagine, uh, electricity is probably the number one uncontrolled expense for any owner. Because most people, look, I'm probably the same way, but if I go on vacation and electricity and utilities are included, Windows AC. go open, AC's, AC's on full speed. Full speed. We're going to, to the, the beach beef. because I want the fridge open with, with the, the beers open in the fridge being seven. cooled by the AC no units. No consideration. No consideration. Mm -hmm. And why would they? It's not their business. It's your business and our business to manage, maintain right. that. So what we do with that is that we take a photo of the uh, meter uh, of exactly the count of the kilowatts before they enter. And then when they exit, we do that meter tracking. The tenant and the owner get a copy of uh, each one of those. The readout. And then we calculate at the appropriate kilowatt per hour used back to the tenant. So all of this information is also very clear in the renter's uh, package that they receive in their communication uh, before they arrive here in the Dominican Republic. That's very important. We know as most things are done electronically these days, we have to be very, very sure that we detail it in the right way, so there is no nobody upset with us. I yeah, didn't no know, hidden, no I hidden didn't charges. Know. So when when you're checking out, you're like, oh no, I didn't know anything about extra cost for electricity. So yeah. yeah. So I'll go into the next thing for people to think about because when you hire a management company, you want to have uh, be sure that you have transparency in uh, in everything you do. So with us, after every single reservation that is received online or from our direct booking sources, you will receive a copy. Uh, of the reservation itself so that you can keep track of each booking that you have by a certain time of the month or upcoming months uh, for your own personal accounting. After, at the end of every month, we as a, our finance and accounting team will prepare a summary invoice uh, detailing every invoice, uh, sorry, every reservation, uh, anything we had to, that was broken and had to be replaced with your auth authorization, uh, and then come to a net amount and of course, we'll have your banking information on file so we can deposit or wire transfer the money directly to you in your home country or your Dominican bank account here. That's very important. Once a month, at the end of every month, we recap and we settle up on those things. It brings back into the next thing, which is how we handle things when it comes to uh, daily maintenance and repair and 24-hour items. So why don't you guys talk about that? Well, basically... Um, like Patrick says, we have everything in house. We have the electrician, the plumber. Um, we even take care of the maid service. So we have the maid on call 24/7. So once you, someone checks out, usually within two to three hours, we already have somebody in that unit already cleaning and counting all the knives and forks. I mean, if they're simple little things, we're not going to invoice you for them. But I mean, if you break the TV, the blender, or whatever, but we do have complete like i said from the maintenance of the property the pool electricians painters everything we take care of it all even your transportation to and from and around locally yeah i like that. right uh my background is uh from the states as a contractor 
I implied that here. I'm 11, 12 years here in Las Terrenas. So I have, between me and Mike, we have the whole setup. Like you said, from ground keepings to remodel, everything that you can imagine, we have a group of guys that can attack it, address it with a phone call. And um, we just want the owners to know that they're, once they sign with us, they're yeah. free. Yeah. They don't have to stress out, what if something happens in the middle of the night, something's leaking, those phone calls would be directed to me. I call and get it addressed immediately. So this is what we're offering. Yeah. Yeah. Aside from worry free. Yeah. Worry free, that's what we want. And I know based on my experience in Canada, uh, we our biggest problem always were vacant units with frozen pipes or price pipes that burst. I guarantee you we're not going to have that issue here. <laughs> no. No and pipes. in our management contracts, snow removal and uh, making sure your salt uh, uh, walkways are salted A so nobody slips, the... that's included. It's no charge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but th that's the point. Uh, we want to make sure that uh, when people mo uh, leave, let's pretend they're checking out at 10 o'clock, we're there at 10 o'clock to receive any remotes back and do the checkout process. Make sure the AC units are off. Yeah. The lights are off. The fans are off. Uh, and most likely also unplugging the fridge to make sure that we don't have any uh, usage uh, happening automatically with uh, utilities uh, that go uncalled for. Now, it's a different story if we have a tenant moving in the same day. We'll keep those items uh, on with the exception of the AC. But you get the idea, is that we want to be efficient, we want to have great profit for our clients, and then we want ease of management and good communication both with the owners and the and tenants. And with the tenants. Yeah. Um, what else? Ah, a good thing that we've, we've talked about internally, and it's up to each individual owner to uh, uh, agree to this or not, but we would encourage you to uh, buy a ring, um, ring doorbell. Ring doorbell camera phone. Because we love to be accountable to our efforts. So if you agree, we'll get that ring a doorbell, install it. We will have access to it, and then you will have access to it. Because then you'll see if anyone is entering your apartment or house without your knowledge, without a reservation. Uh, uh, and then we would also know that as management. That's important. We want absolutely nobody entering the property that is not part of our team. Uh, unless it's a reservation yeah. and we should only be there as your team uh, to provide service and all of those services generally speaking are during the day yeah. uh, landscaping uh, pool uh, cleaning yeah whatever. Uh, and security the main thing it's an added wanna, security without a yeah. doubt the main thing is just 100 percent transparency so you and the owner feel comfortable with us and the tenants as well and uh, i would say only uh in the, in the business of property management, you essentially have to think like a criminal because anything can happen. We can have someone enter the property and if we didn't have a renter for a week, somebody could hop the fence and, and, and sleep outside. You know, that, that's not unheard of. It can happen, but that's why we need security. We need surveillance. There's a whole bunch of ways we can think about it, but I just wanted to mention that as a, we will think about all aspects of how anybody in or outside of our team can take advantage of what the situation is in the trust of us managing it as a company. Yeah. And that's uh, very important for us. Okay. Sounds like a plan. So, Touched on everything. Perfect. We, we talked about everything we thought we were going to talk about today, but let's just pause right for a second. I'll see if we think of anything. And say it's 32 degrees Celsius. Do you hear the waves in the background? The beach. And the beach. So, with that said, uh, today is uh, Labor Day in North America. Yep. So happy Labor happy Day. Happy Labor Day, guys. It's all downhill to cold from here for the winter. So we look forward for you uh, uh, visiting us here in the Dominican Republic. And know full well that as a real estate company, we have your back with sales advice, buying or selling, mortgage for acquisition and refinancing, property management, short-term rentals. We have all the team of professionals around us engineers, architects, legal advice, um, you name it. You we name ha it, we have it all it. covered. So on behalf of Alex Gomez and Michael Francis, Patrick Johnston, cheers for now. See you again. Oh yeah, first, sorry. I'm giving the cue.
Our WhatsApp number is 829-525-1782. Make sure you text us 6 a.m. to 11 p.m. Monday to Saturday. Let me know what you're thinking about, like how we can help you. Like, like, subscribe. Like, subscribe. Oh, and share and it. don't wear white after Liberty. <laughs> <Don't wear> <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Take care. Take care. Bye. Bye.